All right, well, I'm outside in the Nine News backyard with Mike Moore here with the Associated Landscape Contractors of Colorado. Yeah. And it's that time of year where the days are getting shorter, and as we get closer into fall, talk to me a little bit about how uh, landscaping with uh, lighting can really help your, your, your lawn, help your, your property. Yeah, there's, there's, there's several benefits. You know, the ones I like to focus on is, you know, increased accessibility, um, the safety and security aspect, and then just general ambiance. You know, you really can make a place pop um, by, by putting some of this in and, and really we love the outdoors here in Colorado, you know, and it's the weather's nice enough that if you get home and you you want to still have that time outside and you just need a little extra light, that's exactly where this comes in. All right, and I'm seeing we have a lot of different shapes and sizes. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, can you talk to me a little bit about what the difference yeah. is? Yeah, I mean, what's great is from the aesthetic standpoint, you know, they've really opened up styles and colors, you know, so something more traditional to more modern, but but generally have, you know, things like path lighting, which really help us get from point A to point B, or maybe highlight some flowers in the garden. Uh, you have your up lights or sometimes these are mounted in a downward fashion to highlight let's say a water feature or some of those darker spots in your yard that you, it's always been a bit of a you know what's what's back there and you want to get some extra light these these are these are fixtures for that and uplighting your trees and then we have like our hardscape and niche lighting where you know you can put these on stairs to make sure that you're not going to lose that whole tray of uh, hamburgers or something you know <laughs> uh, so we have some this kind of does the accessibility and uh, safety aspect and so we are in our hardscapes and then these great little lights that you can really put up into places that you know those those little secretive nooks where the effect is over there but the light is actually elsewhere and so they really highlight some more of the architectural elements of the yard so these are you know there's, there's tons of fixtures out there uh, to meet all the different needs of the landscape all right and we live in a highly technical world we yeah. have smartphones smart houses you can control your whole house with just your voice so yeah. talk to me about if there's any sort of yeah. smart possibilities with these lighting well what's great is they're now all basically led which is you know hugely efficient long lasting um, but they have these great controllers now too so it kind of pin timers are of days of old you know we've got Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and so you can actually take an, old, an existing transformer and use these to plug into it to control your lights from your phone or some of the newer transformers actually have this technology built in and they even have color changing lights and so that's you know that's really fun for if you're celebrating uh, an event or a holiday that can really uh, you know take your game up a notch for the neighbors so it's all fun. right so with all of the dis these different sizes placements flat tall you know mm -hmm. smart are all of these lighting systems the same or is one better than the other? How do you go about choosing? You know, there's always, um, you know, a, a, a price point that is going to meet someone's need, which is great. Um, for landscape lighting systems, if you're really trying to uh, make it last and make it look great, I do recommend making this more of an investment. I would just recommend, you know, using parts that are metal, waterproof, high quality ele electronics, because, you know, with our, we got so much sun in Colorado, and the weather, the dogs and the kids, you know, things, these things are going to take a bit of a beating. So you want them to last. So Certainly, again, there's price points all over the place, but a really well-built system is going to last. And, uh, you know, I think doing a little research or contacting a landscaper to help you with this is, you know, a great choice. Fantastic. And such great information here. So if you would like a review or, you know, you need some additional tips for lighting your lawn, go ahead and head over to 9news.com. That's where we'll have this entire story.